I can't believe I've done this. I have never expected to make such a grave mistake. No person should ever go through this suffering. No one should be made to watch Morbius, even on death row, but I did. And in honor of no one caring about Madame Web, I thought I should recap the whole movie in under three minutes. Let's get right to it, start the timer. The film opens on a 10 year old Michael Morbius who has a blood illness that means he can't walk without crutches. He meets his new friend Milo, who also suffers the same illness, and they are cared for by their adoptive father, Emil Nicholas. He then takes Michael to New York to pursue a career in medicine whilst he takes care of Milo back in Greece. Cut to 2019 and we see the greatest superhero of all time win a Nobel Prize for his work on artificial blood. Michael then asks for the assistance of Dr. Who's, sorry, Milo, to fund an illegal expedition to Costa Rica. At the destination, Michael slices his hand, trying to get the attention of vampire bats and tries to become Batman. Sorry, wrong universe. Michael and Martina are on a ship full of mercenaries trying to conduct further trials of the serum that is supposed to cure his blood disease. He tries the experiment on himself and it works. Meanwhile, one of the mercenaries goes to check up on them, but Michael has disappeared. We see Michael on the roof and the mercenary starts shooting, prompting Michael to attack him. This leads to a gruesome fight where we see Michael kills the entire crew besides Martin and drains them of their blood. Michael then undergoes a training montage where we see him learn his abilities and the time limits of the human form before he has to consume blood. Luckily for Michael, remember that fake blood? He can use that. Michael then tries to see the full extent of the limitations of his power so he locks himself in a glass cage and slowly starts transforming. Milo who visits rushes and gives him the fake blood. Milo then finds out that Michael has cured himself and asks for the cure. However, Michael refuses because he can turn Milo into a vampire. Meanwhile, detectives investigate Investigating the ship incident, interrogate Martine who is now in hospital and she calls her a really good lawyer. No, still no. Okay, fine. And after this, one of the nurses at Michael's research lab gets her blood sucked out of her, prompting a further investigation from the detectives. As per every Sony superhero movie so far, Michael gets arrested and interrogated, to which he says, You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. Or something along those lines. He gets thrown into jail and calls for his really good lawyer. Stop doing this. It's Milo, who hands Michael a pack of fresh blood and walks away. This makes Michael realize that Milo was the one who took the serum and was the one that killed the nurse lady from before. Michael then breaks out of prison and tracks Milo down, leading to them to fight in the subway and Michael flies away as the cops arrive in the scene. Michael then meets up with Martin and they acquire a new lab, but Morbius makes the funniest joke in the history of cinema. I am Venom. They then use this lab to create a cure for the vampireness of the serum. Milo then goes to meet Nicholas, you know, the adoptive father, and then kills him. Michael arrives too late, however, and then Milo also kidnaps Martine and stabs her, causing her to also die. Michael then sucks her blood and starts to fight Milo. Michael then manages to summon an army of bats at Milo. Bro's literally Batman. Then Michael stabs Milo with the antibody and kills Milo. It is then suggested that Martine is also a vampire, having ingested some of Michael's blood. Then we arrive at the best post credit scene ever. The first one shows Vol arriving into Morbius's universe after the events of No Way Home, which doesn't make sense. Then the second one shows Morbius and Vulture team up to fight Spider-Man or something. I don't really know. Subscribe and make sure to check out this video where I recap all of Venom's appearances in under 5 minutes.